Serena, what the heck are you talking about? Oh, hello. Sharon was already ready for us when we got to the auditorium. It's ridiculous how many first year students are stuffing here. And by the looks of both Sharon are, and Caleb are thinking just the same. Serena doesn't have that much of a reaction. She just motioned for us to keep moving. Your students continue to follow in this massive room even now. I guess there, there are likely at least a couple hundred here alone. I don't know about other regions, but back in Kanto, other big, other than big city schools, it'd be a stretch to have the other, have the number of students in a single grade. Other than big city schools, what kind of small cities have schools? In Kanto, I figured Pewter, Pallet Town only has about four, four kids there, so. Yeah, they're they're homeschooled, or has transferred from like Saffron City or something. Thing is, students from all over the world were enrolled here. If I think about if I think about it that way, a couple of hundred for one grade is pretty selective. Honestly, it took y'all long enough. Ah, uh, go easy on us. We started walking not too long after you left. This is really rough, guys. Instead of clogging the entire entrance here. Oh, jeez. Stop. <laughs> what the heck was that? And, like, what he said was exactly what I was thinking. What Red said was exactly what I was thinking. What the heck was that? All right, all right, everyone. You you can all do your cute intros or catch up with each other later, but please find yourselves a seat. There should be plenty of open spots. Half the people in this room are still brain dead on the floor after that feedback attack. I'm in pain. Ow. That was totally uncalled for. Give me a break. I'll kill you. Flannery, not here. Lose some weight. Sells so Flannery and unnecessary. So, uh oh. Sabrina. <laughs> Come on, now we're on a schedule. Start moving. All right, so that's Flannery and Whitney. Oh, whoops. I screwed up too far. Oh, well. <clears throat> I'm solely uncalled for. Give me a break. I'm reading it over again. I'll kill you. Flattery, not here. Yeah, that's Whitney. Lose some weight. I forgot who that was. Oh, I think he's the guy from White 2. Black 2, White 2. Unnecessary. Sabrina's mad. <laughs> I think that was wrong. Come on, we're on schedule. Start moving. <laughs> oh. Aye, aye, ma'am. <laughs> <coughs> Wait a minute. Is that Roxanne on the podium? That's Roxanne, third year and current student council president. Of course that is Roxanne. I guess as soon as I... Then again, that would make sense because in, uh... In Saf Ruby Sapphire... She graduated from the uh, from the trainer school in Rustboro to become a gym leader. Then again, I think Sharon did the same. Sharon did the same thing, except he was learning in black and white, and then black and white too became a leader. <clears throat> I'll have to say that was a rather aggressive approach to getting everyone's attention. 
That's an understatement if I've ever heard one. My ears are still ringing. Props for recovering so quickly, though. Jeez. I looked ahead and seen a, see a lone female student now standing by the stage's podium. You either Sharon recognized her voice or he has surprisingly great eyesight for someone who is just on the ground. Shall we sit before she blows our ears off a second time? Good evening, our new friends. Because she seems, looks like she would be the sassy person. Although she looks very different than she would in Omega Ruby off of Sapphire. I'm Roxanne, and to start, I would like to thank the Academy staff here for allowing the council to hold this special event. I hope you will make the most out of this occasion and grant me the opportunity to officially welcome every one of you to this prestigious establishment. <clears throat> Everyone, welcome to Kabak. I forgot how to say it. Academy of Advanced Pokemon Arts and Sciences. While we are calling this event of orientation, I'd like to ask for your patience in this initial assembly before you all return to socializing or attending your personal agendas. For, for the first thing I'd like to cover, <coughs> let me make it crystal clear that it's imperative you reserve a spot for one of the female res Whoa. student residential halls as soon as you can. The one here is Relic Hall, and there are two more, Pledge Hall and Aura Hall. Northeast and southeast, respectively, from this location. If you haven't signed up for a room with a roommate, I would strongly recommend you register your student info in the. I'm losing that voice like so quickly. <clears throat> we make matching service where you will automatically be paired with another student. Just think, if you play Conception Two for Nintendo 3DS, think Serena. Anyway. have a room by midnight, the Academy will automatically sign you one and a roommate. It's all first come, first serve, so again, do as soon as you can. Another important item to cover is sky scheduling. And, well, it's just going downhill from here, sorry. All of you here will follow a present class schedule for five periods per day. I'll cover each right now, so if you don't want to wake up confused next week, please pay close attention. The first period of each day is homeroom, lasting two hours. Course subjects will be covered by here by your professor. If you're curious, course subjects including Pokemon and Social Studies, Sciences, Basic Theory, and History. Following homeroom will be an hour of either your Pokemon type elective choice or the gym. The class will alternate each day, so if you have gym today, tomorrow you will have your type elective class. What about gym the day after? What type of electric class you take depends completely on you. As first years, you will be able to select two out of the 18 known Pokemon types to focus your studies on. <coughs> the third period of the day will be the reverse of the previous period, which means it is either a type of elective class or the gym alternating each day. This will be the second Pokemon type elective of your choice. Alright. To make it extra clear, this means that you will always have one of your type of cl elective classes and one gym each session each day. From noon starts your lunch hour. The main cafeteria is at the student center in the middle of the campus. You are also more than welcome to prepare your own meals ahead of time. After that, the fifth and final period is one more session of homeroom, lasting two hours. Your total lasts seven hours from 8 a.m. to 3 p.m. between 3 and 6 p.m. All academy research and extracurricular facilities are designated for individuals or groups to use. After that, they will require permits for access. Keep that in mind, as school date officially is after 6 p.m. I do hope that wasn't too much of an information overload. Once classes are in session, I trust all of you are able to develop such a comfortable routine. Quite honestly, she looks... She looks easier, like, her expression on her face looks easier than uh, she would, once again, on uh, the third gen remake, Omega Ruby Alpha Sapphire. Like many professors have said in the past, your own adventure is about to begin. This is Kabo Kabalkin, 
I can't remember how to say it. Academy, it being here is your pride. Working together, we wish to foster an environment where you can believe your own goals and take every prop that 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 set itself before you. But try as we might, the reality is not everything will always go your way. Not every opportunity will be for everyone, and not every door will be open to you. However, you should find you should. However, should you ever find yourself in a situation where you feel trapped and helpless, remember you can always create your own door and travel your own path. Have a great rest of the day, everyone, and don't forget to get those sign-ups done. <coughs> well then, <coughs> I was thinking about arranging to meet with Varxan. I forgot his voice. But what do what do you all want to do? There we go. I have to pass on such a meeting for now. I'd rather head back to pick my two electives and get that out of the way. We should probably head back. It's been a long day. Yeah, I think that's a good idea. What do you think, Sharon? I kind of just want to get that scheduling thing done, too. Grab some dinner, kick back, and just relax. But, oh, if you don't mind, Kim, we can all exchange contacts. We can meet up again, especially if Sharon is planning on meeting with Roxanne. I'm going to say... There we go. Okay, whatever. I'm assuming it's about the student council. Hmm. Let's meet again another time. Let's meet again another time. Let's meet again another time. I can't remember his voice. I. It's been too long. You're right. It's been a. Wait. You're right. It's been a very long day. That's settled then. Here. Da, 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 da. There we go. I'll be heading out this way another time. Bye guys. Let's go then, Rashad. And that guy's voice that quickly again. <clears throat> as far as our belongings were delivered to our room safe and sound while we were away. It shouldn't take too long to unpack everything, but I can take my time with that throughout the week. All I need to do is get the get the necessities set up for now. The room was such more spacious than I expected. I wasn't a huge fan of hard work floor, but other than that, I really can't complain. At the college I am at, all of the floors are carpet. <laughs> Especially in the dorm rooms. Each person has his own bed, desk, cabinet, the sander, but there was so much space and leg room in between. Heck, if you don't, if, heck, if you don't, heck, if you divide the room in half, it's probably the same size as my room back in pallet, if not bigger. I spent way too much time looking around and around. I barely started unpacking my belongings. This might be tough, but let's begin. Which two type electives will you use? There are 18 known Pokemon types. Fire, water, grass, electric, normal, fighting, flying, psychic, poison, ground, rock, bug, ghost, steel, dark, type, dark, ice, dragon, and fairy. I have to decide carefully which two types should be my electives for this year. Hmm. Oh, the, the track started over. Let's see, which ones should I start off with? I like electricity. One more to go. Hmm. I like steel. So steel and electricity. <clears throat> I see you picked electric and steel. I choose normal and dark types. It seems like it seems we won't be classmates in that regard. Don't slack off, though. 
and we've just one more week before classes begin. There's much left to be done, but we can certainly call today productive. He's right, just one week to go. Despite the heavy force of exhaustion bearing down on me, I continue to sort through my belongings, finish unpacking everything. <coughs> the full one set of night was here and going to sleep would be common sense. However, being able to fall asleep was a different story to say I was excited about would be a blatant lie. lie. I'm hundreds of miles away from home, and now I'm here at this academy with countless new people to meet. Just one more week. I can't wait. I think that's the end of the demo. What Pokemon Cry was that? Okay. Oh, we has fast. Wait a minute. <clears throat> it's only the first day of classes. For the past week, I spent most of my time studying my room, getting used to the campus. Sharon has a lot of books and a printer. Red Call is surprisingly big as it has an auditorium capable of fitting a couple hundred people, a lounge that doubles as a cafeteria, a library, but I say I'm pretty good at finding my way around now. I haven't checked the floors above, but as far as I know, all these all three student floors are more or less the same. I also haven't been able to check out the academy building yet. It's been like off limits for the past week and it's finally open today. I'm dying to see who will be in my classes. The same that same chill I felt when I got here snuck up on me again. Again it's a get chill. I'm ready. Oh dear. <clears throat> ready to get some breakfast before the big day? We're heading to the main cafeteria? That's the plan. The main cafeteria isn't too far of a walk from Hall. Uh, uh, it's also conveniently located in the middle of campus next to the main academy building where we'll be attending our classes. Hello? <laughs> The main the main cafeteria is absolutely massive. Well, the other the student center is a whole is a massive building, second only to the academy's main building itself, which all the students refer to as the academy. Here in this cab, hundreds of students can be seated simultaneously and most importantly, comfortably. At first, I thought the space would be an issue, but I was surprised to find out the opposite was true. Morning hours tend to be the most hectic as students from all type different grades file in, but operations run smoothly none, nonetheless. <coughs> Holy crap. A shady penguin crossed my path. It certainly makes things easier when various Pokemon help with service while the academy staff handles the cooking and talking. Then again, this is the only, only place that serves food on campus. Many students opt for smaller cafes and lounges located in other buildings as, such as the students facilities or residential halls <coughs> we're just here because it's close to our classes <coughs> sharon holy crap i'm really confused because i saw the guy from Black two, white two. I think he was the brother of the sister who Spurlone was missing. <clears throat> I don't know who this guy is. I think she's the girl, the chick from uh, Pokemon White and Black, the first one. Anyway, R Rashad. Morning, Hilbert. Hilda. Good morning, you two. Didn't expect to see you two here. I thought you'd be headed directly towards class. We did head toward the academy. Barely anything's open. Have the homework assignments been posted yet? No, and... Don't tell me I might have missed the... Anyway, 
and that's probably the most annoying part. We weren't the only we weren't the only early ones check they're checking for news. It seems the school's administration is always taking its time. We we just started. Maybe they're just easing us into the process. Or you know, maybe give students a little more time to appear, prepare on the first day. No matter. The bottom line is that we have some time before we should start heading towards the academy building. Rashad and I plan to get some breakfast here her to begin with. I see. We ate a little in Relic Hall's lounge. So someone had to be left behind. Uh, where is she? Hilbert and Hilda are both from Sharon's hometown in the Unova region. The three of them were friends home before they enrolled in the academy. I didn't get the chance to talk to Hilbert and Hilda much in the past week, but coincidentally we all had rooms on the same floor, so we ran into each other a few times. Oh yeah, that's right. They're co-ed dorms, but guys room with guys, girls with girls, and so forth, so on, anyway. Or either there's a floor or something. That didn't make sense, though. There's the only three floors in the building. The most seri ridiculously serious people. I thought Sharon was serious enough when I first met him. That would, ima that would imagine those are the... Those two are the... Playable characters in the game. Anyway, knowing the three of them hang out together, it makes too much sense. But Hilbert said they left somebody behind. Oh dear. Oh dear. <laughs> Sad to say that I don't think they'll be mentioning her because uh, I think they were working on the, that person's art whenever I was over at Second Shake. Honest, honestly. Left your own roommate behind, Hilda? Well, Sharon did that to me before the orientation last week, too. I wouldn't be surprised if he does it again. It's not like I wanted to, but she needs to learn to pick it up sometime. So sorry. That has to be Bianca. Wait, that was the that was who they were working on. On the, oh wait, they were probably working on it for the actual game. Am I late again? Bianca, how long have I known you? Well, over 10 years? Still no sense of time to this day. Sorry, Jared, everyone. I saw so many wonderful Pokemon on my way here. They're all helping the school staff with morning duties. Just try to keep up next time, Bianca. It's the first day of classes, so it's important to stay on top of everything that's going on. Got it, Hilda. The most important thing is you made it here, right? Oh, Rashad is so nice. Careful, Rashad. You don't want to spoil her. She has the attention span of a caterpie, so we try to make sure she remains focused on. Oh, oh, oh no! I just remembered. I'm stuck in the bug type elective. Stuck in the bug type elective? Apparently, she didn't register in time. She wanted grass, but it ended up in bug. Okay. She did get... She d I'm doing too many girls' voices. She did get into normal type class, though. Hilbert picked fire and fighting, while I picked water and steel. Bianca, I picked normal as well. We'll be in the same class. I'll be in the same class as Hilda, then. Because I picked steel. Oh, really? Really? Ooh, I'm so happy and excited. I thought I'd be stuck with strangers all here. Even if none of us are in classes, Bianca, you should try to enjoy... Where'd Hilbert go? Is that one of the main reasons why you came here in the first place? You're right, Hilda. I feel bad after arguing with Papa, so I should wouldn't let... So he wouldn't let me go to the school. Is it just me or no... Or did no one notice Hilbert walk off on his own? It's just... What... <laughs> hey! How much? That's just... <laughs> what? Oh, not much. I'm doing some sort of demo that I've seen Patters do. Like yeah. That's just what he does when he's no longer interested in a conversation. I bore him! You sound way happier than you should be, Bianca. Well, it seems everything worked out okay for Bianca. I heard the story briefly before. She has rather open protective ears, especially her father, and she had a hard time persuading them to let her enro enroll at the academy. I remember Sharon always telling me that it was one time Bianca raised her voice. Of course, I hadn't known her all that long, but I can't picture Bianca except upset like that. Whoa. I think I scrolled up again by accident. I think we spent enough time here. I should probably look for Hilbert. 
Sharon, Rashad, feel free to me as at the academy feeling when you're done eating. Come on, don't fall behind again, Bianca. See you later. So most of the Unova people are roommates with each other, so... Except I'm Gen 1 and roomed up with Sharon. By choice, though. Let's move along, Rashad. I do want to catch up to them sooner or later. Where are you going? I'm leaving. Oh, okay. Have a good day, man. You too. And that was my roommate just now. Speaking of roommates, <laughs> that works for me. Character card is updated. If we were not the only ones who were anxious, this the un the unintelligible but fervent clamoring blah 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 all contributed to the infectious type hype. Back home, or rather, any school for me to reach out. That's possible to find so many students that decided about their first days as students here. All I made because I became a victim of this atmosphere. I ate quickly like a madman, shoving the last piece of toast onto my mouth like the many students before we me and got up from my seat. Oh, this area of the campus is amazing. There's a lot more to this demo than Batter showed. I look up and see the symbols embo embossed on the fa facade. Kobukin, Kobukin Academy. Supposedly, wait a minute. Those hieroglyphs on the top of the gate are a bunch of unknown. Supposedly. This building has been around for nearly a century. I have no idea. Th anyway, I've cer I certainly have no idea if that's a rumor or not because the condition makes it look like it was built recently. I have a difficult time imagining that this is what I'll be looking at for this day on. Well, yes, I'll get used to it eventually. Not a word of complaint for me. First thing on the agenda is to check the homeroom assignments, right, Sharon? He burnt out on me. Hmm. I knew it was a little quiet, even with all the students here. Did I walk ahead too fast? Maybe I'll head on the side and check the assignments on my own first. The demo ends it. Oh, there we go. But there's a lot more. Blah, blah, blah. Man, that's it. But hey, there's a bunch of other paths you can take for some variation. As the game goes on, blah, 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 blah. I know who she is. Whoa. This there's Brendan. Serena. I forgot. I forgot her name. That looks like Trevor. But then again, I don't know a lot of the Gen 4 gym leaders, so... Your choices would depend on who you meet. And you can't just find everyone right away. Sometimes it comes down to your choices and you just need to be patient. Um, I don't know how to say this, but good luck. Pokemon Community Forum. Pokemon Visual Twitter account. I think I checked that already. Make sure you're reporting bugs or anything very general. Thanks for playing. Alright, and they're thanking me for playing. And I'm thanking you guys for coming out and watching this. I think I might just for fun actually um, check out the other two people. Three people. Two people. Let's see, there was Sharon, there was... The guy Patters checked. I don't think there were still other people, but I'm gonna check out the other two people. I might actually record the record that and uh, deliver it onto YouTube as well. But anyway, thank you guys for watching. If you liked it, click like. And if you want to actually see a lot more or see more like Pokemon kind of gameplay, because I'm currently doing Metroid Prime 2 at the moment. But if you like, I'll uh, try to put in. A little bit of Pokemon every now and then. 
But anyway, thank you guys for watching. I'm Chris, the Musician, where ga because gaming is my instrument. What's yours?